When would you ever use the geometric mean instead of the arithmetic mean? Here's one example. Say that you bought $100 in stocks, and at the end of year one, the stocks went up 10%. And at the end of year two, the stocks went up 20% from that. So the question is, what is the average annual percentage increase? Now, the arithmetic mean of 10% and 20% is 15%. So if we use the arithmetic mean to find the average annual percentage increase, we see that we wouldn't get the same result as what actually happened. When we are multiplying, when things are compounding, we would use the geometric mean. So we would do the square root of 1.1 times 1.2. And we need to include these ones over here because the money is increasing. So if these have to be the same number, it would be around 14.89%. And we see that we get the same result as what actually happened when we do that. And we can do this with three or more numbers. So when we are constantly multiplying, when things are compounding, when these percentages have to be the same, we would use the geometric mean instead of the arithmetic mean. Now, if you want to see the geometric mean visualized, scroll up to watch my last video.